husband and wife, and, and um, we've t we we own the Adventure Bay General Biz Store business, and we've been there for three and a half years. Mark's worked there for our best part of 11. Good on you. Yes, good on. and um, you know we we love the business, and it's been good to us. But um, for you know, in terms of age and health and that, we we. We're looking at selling. The time has come. Yeah, the time has come. Yeah, that's it. As it stands, it's been here for 30 years. It was a business before that. Yeah. I've grown up coming here, and originally the shop was what we called Muskets, so the, the Muskets owned a shop which was further down the road. And after that time, then the shop moved here. And it's always been, even as even as my children coming down here and that, you know, like that, the, the shop's always been, the, you know, go and get lunch at the shop and things like that, so it's been great. The other thing, you know, um, I suppose locals and, and Jill that had the shop before, they've all come in and they've said, you know, I can't believe what you're selling in here now. So, so it doesn't matter what you introduce, it is going to sell. It has got so much potential. And probably looking into a liquor license. Yeah, yeah. Absolutely, yeah. Um, and I think there's a lot of potential for that one. Yeah. We're the only fuel serve on the island, yeah. for the entire island, so we, we accommodate, you know, and, and looking at that is essential vehicles as well, so you've got the fire, ambulance and and police, don't you, Mark? They all police, come here. Yeah. We find, I would say, 99.9% .9 of the customers that come in are always happy. They like the service. Um, you know, many of them come back, don't they, Mark? You get to know them. You know, they'll come here yearly. The, the local community that support us and uh, and just the staff itself. So, so having the business uh, with the staff, it's a bit like family. Yeah. And we spend that much time with them that it's, it is actually like part of our family. We truly have, um, I get tingles when I talk about it because we wouldn't be here without them. And um, they put up with us and they're just, they, they, they always are having fun as well. But under pressure, they are extraordinary. And, and, and in summer you are under pressure and it is full go, you know, and we, and we try and staff accordin accordingly. There are times when someone might be sick or something happens and we're under the pump, but I tell you what, these guys, they're, they're just amazing. I, I could not, I, I, I couldn't pick a better team. Uh, amazing. I, I will actually miss having something, something to do, even though I'm talking about retirement. I love, I love it. Like, I actually love the pace. I love, the busier we are, the more they love it. And, and um, I guess I'm just one of these people I always like having something to do. And, and, the, and the staff, you know, having that camaraderie all the time. It's just, it's just amazing. You don't have time to um, worry about yourself or have a flat day. You literally don't have time. You get out there and it just keeps pumping it along, doesn't down, it, Mark? Yeah. yeah. So, so I, there, there's so, there's actually so many things about it that I will miss. And um, I suppose, so even though we're going, there's a big part of me that doesn't want to. I'm just being a realist. Um, so the big part of me would, you know, the big part would just keep going and because there's so much potential, there's so much to do. And I love it. I, I, we, we do love it or we wouldn't have done it. Yeah.